All right, welcome back to day five of my seven days of seven days that I series. Today, we are going to try and look for that airdrop because I believe it might have just despawned the icon in the minibar. So I'm going to try and take a look and see if I can still find it. I'm going to raid some houses and I need to grab rocks to make cobblestone rocks for my defenses. Spikes as well. I might go and grab as many spikes as I possibly can. Let's get into it. Okay, we're back in. First up, I'm going to move... Nope, I need the wrench first. I need the wrench here. Okay, let's go out and grab the airdrop. Oh, hey, what's up, dude? Um... <laughs> let's run in this direction and we'll try and find the airdrop. I know it was around here somewhere. Like, around this gray area. So we're going to take a look. Yeah, I'm going to pick up some of these along the way as well. Because maybe we can get mechanical parts. Or electrical parts. Uh-oh. I didn't know how close you were. Alright, well, <laughs> goodbye. Thanks for coming. <laughs> oh my god, it's just a deposit of stone. Oh my god, this is amazing. Hey, what's up, dude? You can't dodge these sledgehammer bullets. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> Alright, where am I? Okay, let's get, keep going a little bit further. Because we might have to double back. Okay, no, you didn't die. We might have to double back soon. I just don't want to go out too far. Imagine you're just sleeping, right? You wake up in the morning, and you look outside, your car has been broken down into parts. Or even disappeared entirely. I assume I just get the, uh, the airdrop. Oh my god, another one. I assume I just get the airdrop icon, and I'd be able to see it, but... Don't think it's appeared yet. Of course you have unpoured cement. Ugh, so annoying. That's a giant lob of stone, you see that? That's crazy. You dead? Okay, cool. Why did you just move again? Okay, well, I've gone out pretty far. I'll head back a little bit that way. No, I feel like it's it's more up. I'll go back a little bit that way after I get some stone. And then I'll head back. Okay, 2200 has got to be enough. I'm going to head off just up a little bit to see if the airdrop spawns in. And then we'll see. If it doesn't spawn in, I'm running back. Yep, thought so. I was like, where the heck? No, there's definitely a zombie in here. <laughs> I was like, where could it be? Yeah, behind the door. Alright, uh, the airdrop has not spawned in. Like, I can't see any things for it. So, just to make doubly sure... I'm looking for it. I can't see it. I'm going to head back over this way, just so I can get this bit off the map, and then I'll head back home. Just to be 100% sure that I haven't missed it. Uh, yeah, I'm... I don't know where the airdrop is. <laughs> Annoyingly, I don't know where the airdrop is. So I'm just going to leave it. Am I getting attacked by a bird right now and I just don't know it? Yeah, I am. God damn it. <laughs> what the heck is this? Whoa, are those landmines? All the way around? Is this another trader? They really need to up their, like, landmine, uh, thing. Because that just looks like a, a tire. What, what, is, what is the thing on the tire called? Okay, let's just head back. I'm... 
It's 10 o'clock, I haven't done anything. I mean, I am crafting cobblestone and spikes, which I've just done. So let's just craft more cobblestone. How much can I craft? Craft that. If I can craft a cement mixer, like before day seven, I'll have cement around my house, which is just basically I win. Like, I can just sit in the, the house all day, the bunker. Okay. You still cooking? Yeah, you are. So, I need you in there. Not like that. You in there. I mean, I have a thousand cement. I just need a cement mixer, right? Or do I need more materials along with that? Cobblestone rocks. Um, I will fix the house. Okay, how do I make a workbench? That's... Come on, let me type it. Workbench. Forged iron, mechanical parts, wrench, claw hammer, wood. Okay. How many mechanical parts do I have? 31. Okay, what do I need to make a cement mixer? I need an engine. Airdrop. Where are you? Oh my god, that's so far. Ugh. Okay. Uh, what we can do... We can take a look at the trader to see if he's got an engine. And then I think I'll just grab some coffee and go grab that airdrop. I don't have any coffee. He's hoping that the trader has an engine or that airdrop has an engine. I don't think the airdrop will just drop an engine, but yeah, we'll see. If you are here to buy, I've got the best selection of medicine in the wasteland. Gonna say no, they don't have an engine. I don't think engines can be crafted either. Chemistry don't station. Let a zombie dog bite you in the ass on your way out. And if he does, hey, we'll take care of it for you. I don't have a beaker anyway. Okay, well they don't have an engine. You can't craft them, can you? No, you can't. You have to find them naturally. So it means I don't think I'm gonna get a cement mixer. Which is annoying. Okay, let's go for a workbench then. Because I know we can craft a workbench. Forged iron mechanical parts, wrench, claw hammer, wood. Now, I think they do consume the wrench and the claw hammer. Okay, while that is going... Oh, I need the claw hammer to upgrade. Ew. Okay, we'll just get all the materials we need to do it. And then I'll craft it during the night. I don't know what I can use the workbench for yet. But I'll figure that out later. Let's go get this airdrop. I'll be back in a sec. Uh-oh. Did I go the, the wrong way? I feel like I did. Ugh, I go all the way around. Look, because that's never-ending. And I know I can go around the left way, so i got to go all the way around the left. God damn it. Hey, dude. Bye, dude. Oh, sorry about that body. Yeah, goodbye. Uh, it's still going. <laughs> See ya. D ah, again. <laughs> I think I'm. I think I'm just getting around it, and it's like, nah, -uh, nah, -uh, you're not even close. There's a giant chasm between me and the airdrop. Uh, this airdrop better be amazing. It better give me like guns, a turret. Spikes, everything I need to defend myself. Because I'm wasting, like, a lot of time getting it. Okay, finally, what do we get? God damn it, I just... I mean, ten vegetable stew is pretty good. But I'm still annoyed. Hello. Yeah, come to me. Whoa, hold on. This could be good. I mean, it's not, but it could be good. <laughs> okay, we are back home yet again. Let me in. There we go. Let's dump all of. Okay, yeah, sure. That's what I wanted to do anyway. Well, that was a that was a trick. Might have been wasted, but I mean, I have antibiotics, so if I get infected, night or day six or seven, then I'm good. Vegetable stew I'm going to keep on me just for eating, as as you do. I'm going to- where are my bullets gone? Let's just take some of these bullets back. 
We are going to get rid of the claw hammer, but I have a stone axe I can use instead. Yeah, it actually literally got rid of them. Can I make a claw hammer? For 36 forged iron. Oh, for a level 5. Okay, hold on. What's the next step? So it is 6 o'clock. What's the next step? Do I just go get some more wood? So I can have some more spikes? I feel like that's the next best play. I've only got 900 on me. How much do I have in storage? 800. Let's probably get some wood. It can't hurt. How many cobblestone rocks? I've got just under 900 cobblestone rocks. Hmm. So I feel like I need more. Obviously, the more the better, because I don't know how many blocks of wood I've got on my property. <laughs> I feel like 90 should be plenty, right? Hello. You're not dead yet. Ooh, you survived the first hit. Well, oh, didn't survive the second. I have 430 bullets between my two weapons. Plus, I've got extras in the house. Okay. The ultimate test of skill. Now, I can upgrade this door using forged iron. Right? Oh, that one. Yeah, forged iron to upgrade. So, I need to take a look at... Let me just grab, like, 20... No, no, no. 20, not 68. 20 forged iron off you, and I'll see what I can do to upgrade... The doors. Uh, I want hammer. Claw hammer. Forged iron, leather, duct tape. Okay. Let's make one claw hammer, please. Thank you. We have a workbench here. So we can drop you down. Hey, what do you make? <laughs> Cobblestone rocks, I'm guessing? Yep. Okay, it's one to one, whereas my hand is one to one. I assume this makes it faster? Can I make bullets? I can make guns, right? 9mm? Yeah, I can. Bullet tip, gunpowder, bullet casing. I have all that. Bullet tip, bullet casing, buckshot. I don't have gunpowder. I swear I have gunpowder. So, I think we will be good on the cobblestone. I will start cobblestoning after this night. I'll start cobblestoning during this night, sorry. Okay, so I have a claw hammer now. So I just built one. I repair you. What do I do to upgrade you? What, what did that just do? Is there a difference? It took... It took 30 iron? Wait, hold on, what's your... Oh, 5,000. Holy cow, okay. So I just doubled the... Yeah, yeah, you just double the strength of the door. Okay, I'm down with that. Uh, 21. 9 o'clock. We've got one hour. What do we do? I don't want to just stay indoors. That's the issue. <laughs> Let's just play it out. Um, I'll... Trade is probably going to close soon anyway. I'll just double check what they have. Well, aren't you a sight for sore eyes? No, oh, thanks, buddy. Concrete mix. 375 for 50. So it's three grand for all of it. So maybe I can even. Do I go for the concrete mix? I can sell all my gold nuggets. I could probably get some of this. Get a beaker, forged steel, grilled meat. Nothing that's like really jumping out at me. I have 12. There's 12 silver nuggets here. Uh, maybe we just wait for an engine? No, no, no. The engine's gonna be stupid. Because I don't think we're gonna get it. Restock on day seven. So I think what we got to do is buy the concrete mix. That's 400 they had for sale. And I assume it's like, it's the exact same as the cobblestone rocks where it's 10 to upgrade one block. 
So we can upgrade 40. Which won't be a lot, but it's better than nothing. And we're not spending the gold on anything else. Cool. Let's do it again. 7,500. Whoa, okay. Forged steel spring mechanical parts. Okay, I think that's a little bit too far. That's 7,500. This one's 5,000. So I think we should be okay. I think now our biggest issue is the cobblestone walls for defense. We just need to up those as like as much as we can. So I'm going to start upgrading all of the cobblestone. All the walls to cobblestone, sorry. The game lets me. Uh-oh. Oh, no. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. It's a freaking squealer. Well, it wasn't a squealer, but it was a dang maniac. Uh-oh. Anyone else? Okay. Okay. Man, that made my heart tense. <laughs> that made me tense, my heart beat. See, I was even screwing up my words. I was afraid I was going to fall off. Okay, so at the end of this day and night, I have a bunch of stuff smelting. I have some cobblestone rocks still building. I don't know if I need them, but I'm going to make them anyway. Both of these doors have been upgraded. This one is at 7,500 strength, and this one's at 5,000. I have completed all of this all the way around here you will notice that i have at a little bit of a roof here i will get to that in a sec now if we go up we can see that all of the cobblestone oh all the cobblestone all the way around has all been cobblestoned the walls have been cobblestone sorry i'm losing my mind and i've added this roof here now i've added the roof because i want to add spikes all the way around the center and i want to add spikes all the way around the outside but we will get to that in the next episode because i'm gonna have to cut down a lot of trees to make all that happen so, thank you so much for watching. I will see you guys in the next episode. Peace.